So now we're on to day two. We're gonna step into a band. We're gonna do a banded good morning. Now we want you to do this eccentrically. So we're keeping our core engaged, hinging back at our hips, keeping that neutral spine, and then up. We're gonna go down for a slow one, two, three count, back up with one. We're squeezing our glutes on the way back up. Then similar three to one count here. We're gonna do a slow push up, one, two, three. One second up, and then we push to a downward dog. One, two, three, second up, downward dog. Next, we'll take a weight, kettlebell, dumbbell. We're gonna do a single leg or a yell. So hinging through our hips, we're keeping that pelvis level. We don't wanna open up this way. And then we're gonna come up through to one leg. So you're seeing a lot of work in single leg this time around. It's gonna help a lot with your stability when you're running. And we'll follow that with a push press. So two dumbbells tucked in at our side. We're gonna explode up, actually using our legs to press up. So we're using our legs to throw that weight above our head. Then we'll do either a kettlebell, dumbbell at your chest, a lateral lunge to one leg. Followed by a banded fly. So we're gonna pull in using our pecs And our last two here, we've got a side plank, either a full side plank or on knees. We're gonna add in a rotation. So you're gonna reach through like you're giving yourself a hug and then you're gonna come back in. Reach through, give yourself a hug and then back up. And then the last exercise on day two, we're gonna do a suitcase carry march. So kettlebell or dumbbell at your side, core is nice and tight. We're gonna march. Try not to shake, serve back to back, staying nice and level through our hip and our trunk. And that'll be both sides. 